Hi everyone, it's Vicky. Well, it's been a little while since I've done a video and I had to go back and see how far I'd got. So the last time I showed you this sunflower journal, this one there, I, um, I got to this page. So I took a few photos and I've, done, I've put some photos in. I've attached them with washi tape and some glue, but I did want the color of the washi tape. And that was a picture from a magazine and I think I told you about that before. Some more photos. Still attached with that washi. That is a picture that I printed out from Facebook. And there's another photo. This was a seed packet. And that's a little notepad that I did some journaling on. And that was another picture that I printed out from Facebook. And this one. And this one here, oh, I got a bit behind. So I just stamped Wednesday, Thursday, um, Sunday. I just put all the days in there, <laughs> tried to catch up. Um, and I said here, yeah, the days seem to be blurring together. Um, I did a bit of baking, so I've used that packet mix there. And I tried out a new stamp that I've got, and that is some washi tape. And then this page here is a piece of wallpaper. So it's, it's a really pretty piece of wallpaper, and I was saving it to make a cover. And then I saw it, and I thought, I'm just going to use it. So in here, I've got, I've got um, two pages or two days of journaling on that piece of notepaper. And then somebody gave me a card. So I put that in there too. And it's got a scripture. It says, Be still and know that I am God. Psalm 46 verse 10. So that was really special. So I've made a little pocket there. And then this day here, I've done some collage work. So this is from a magazine. It's a little pot plant. There's a piece from a Starbucks wrapper. There's a parking ticket. Just a few odds and ends. And this is from a gift bag. So you can see it's got that little hole punched out and I just took it off and I glued it there. These were some scraps from some fabric. I made some face masks and this was the leftover bits and they've got little birds so I've stapled them on there. And there was another day where I just I wrote Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday because I was a bit behind. <laughs> so And some more days all squished into one page. This was from some fat quarters, and I love this color, this lovely blue color. You can see it sort of matches my scrunchie. And some more photos. And I showed you this over here, and that day I made two. So I found the other one this day, and I just glued it onto here. We went to Ikea that day, or the day before. So there's the a little paper from Ikea and it says make a note of your shopping list or something so I've, I've saved that I've glued it into my page and there was a sunflower from our garden and I made this quilt and so I've stapled a little bit of the fabric over here this page was really fun this was from Royal Ascot so that's the horse racing and this was one of the first pages in a um, catalogue or um, it was a little book that came with it and it's got um, Queen Elizabeth's signature and I love that so I've left that there and some more photos and another little thing from Facebook and a lot of journaling there then this day here I've used a postcard that I was given a few years ago with all the strawberries I love that I did a bit more baking, so I've got my Cherry Bakewell cake box that I've just rounded the corners and I've done a little bit of journaling on the back. And this was from a Chinese restaurant, so that was from the chopsticks. And a little bit more journaling. And 
a friend went to Cyprus and brought me some souvenirs back and one of them was a box of Cyprus delights which are like Turkish delights and so I've cut the box apart and I've saved all the little pictures that were around the edges of the box and I've used this Tim Holtz ladder but I've used it sideways so that I can get all my different pictures in. And then that was from a fridge magnet so it's got a map of Cyprus here and it's got the names of all the places so I wanted to save that piece just so that I could see the, the map and this here is an envelope so one of these one of these envelopes I've torn it apart and I've used the, uh, the inside on the outside and I love the way it looks a bit like honeycomb and then I've made a little card there so you can see the cake mix coming through the window. And that's the cake that I made that day. I'm <laughs> making a lot of cake these days. So that goes in there. And that's as far as I've got. I still am two days behind. But I think I'm going to put them in this page here. And we are now on the 1st of September. And... I think I'm going to try and use this up for the rest of September and then October, November I will use a different journal, probably something with just one signature because this two signature book has now lasted me since May I think. Let's have a look. Yeah, I think since May. But that is my sunflower journal and it's huge. Look at how fat it's looking. And it's got so many fun things. I think I want to add a few more photos because that'll help fill up quite a lot of the space here. And I've got some nice pictures with some more sunflowers. So that'll add to the theme. But so far I'm really happy with my journal. So thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.